1071. I'm Colleen Lindstrom. That's Bradley Trainer. Hi. Holly Roberts, the three of us here on a Friday. What do we do on Fridays? Cheat. Dirty rotten cheetah. Cheat day taste test. Stick this in your mouth. What are we doing? Well, let's be real real, okay? This is uh this is a second part of a series. Exclusive yes. part two. Last week, on the last episode of the Colleen and Bradley Show's Cheat Day, we tried three, count them three, Little Debbie flavors of ice cream. Yummy! I did Cosmic Brownie. Bradley, what did you do? Nutty Bar. Holly, what did you do? Honey Buns. Yes! Well, we have two more flavors. Now, there are four more flavors available. Only two of them were not available. So we got the two that were available. more than enough. Agreed. What do we got? We have Little Debbie... Oatmeal cream pies. Yummy. Ice cream. The OG Little Debbie snack. And we have Little Debbie Swiss Rolls ice cream. Also another OG Little Debbie snack. Look at there's that sweet little gal just looking at us smiling. Which one do you guys want to try first? I do not care. Holly, let's try the oatmeal first. Oatmeal cream pie. Is that the white one I have in front of me? That is the white one, yes. Uh, I can read to you a little bit about it. Um, It's oatmeal cream pie flavored. It's a a cold and creamy twist on a classic treat. Uh, The um, Little Debbie in Hudsonville crafted this delicious oatmeal cream pies inspired ice cream to make special moments sweeter. Now, what I'm seeing looks like some vanilla, but there look to be some flecks of something in there. I would assume there's probably bits of oatmeal cream pie. Uh, yeah, they're it's tiny. They're like tiny flecks. Okay. Oh, you don't have chunks in there. They my, don't appear to be chunks. Yeah, mine looks like. Uh, yeah, I don't see any chunks. Yeah, I mean they're very they're like few and far between. I also have to be honest, you guys. I should have taken this out of the freezer earlier to give it like a little time to be scoopable. Mm-hmm. It was not real scoopable. Bradley, he's all in. What's going on there? Hmm. I mean, it's good ice cream. Hmm. It's very good ice cream. Mm. I don't taste. I don't know if it's just because of my, the piece that I have, but I don't taste any bits. There, you. I had bits in mine, and I didn't taste bits. It tastes good. I mean, vaguely, I kind of can tell that it's oatmeal cream pie right. because I know that it's oatmeal cream pie. I don't know that I would have a heart or a good time like picking that out of a hat, mm-hmm. but it's good. The thing I like, and we talked about this uh, last week, that the good thing about these. Um, novelty ice creams is that they're actually ice cream like you can tell it's real ice cream absolutely it's not that like ice milk stuff like what you said bradley um i don't know that i would take a bite of this not knowing that it was a little debbie flavor and put my finger on oatmeal yeah. cream pie. unless i ate maybe like the whole pint and got some big honky chunks. excuse me <laughs> honky tonk honky tonk chunks holly your <laughs> thoughts yeah it's great don't necessarily know that it would be a little Debbie oatmeal cream pie experience right. if not for the prompt. Yeah. That being said, I would eat a whole serving of this. I mean, it's good ice cream. It is yeah, good. It is good ice cream. Um, and like you said, Bradley, it's not like terrible ice milk. It's Hudsonville ice cream. It's like actually good Yeah, it ice says cream. ice cream on the package, which you cannot right. say if it's not ice cream. Mm-hmm. And it's surprising how much ice cream you think ice cream is not actually ice cream. Ooh, That's say all I'm going to say. Yeah. Okay, I have to apologize to you guys because like I said... I should have taken these out to make them more scoopable. And I think I did not get you guys the most varied. Like, I didn't get all the stuff in the next flavor, I don't think. Okay. I see swirls. You do see swirls. Okay, because yes. there's some something. creamy swirls looks in like there. Looks like chocolate with some stuff. Yep, there looks like there's some chocolate, um, I don't know, mm. bits in mm-hmm. this in this uh, Swiss roll. Oh. Little Debbie ice cream. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's... I mean, I can taste a Swiss roll in that one. Mm-hmm. Okay, because I was going to say, you look... Like you're mm. enjoying and that this ice cream experience. is really good. Is it? That's good chocolate ice cream. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, that one has like chunks. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm. There is Swiss it's roll. Very good. In the Swiss roll ice cream. I like that one better, but I think it's because I like chocolate better. Let's be clear. So last week I tried that cosmic brownie ice cream, mm-hmm. and the base of that was a chocolate ice cream. Yeah. And this is just really good chocolate yeah. ice cream. Is it the same base as the cosmic brownie? It tastes like it, but that the um creamy stuff gives it a different um layered depth. Oh yes. Use those food terms. Thanks. I will. 
Um, but no, it was umami. It was really good. No, it's real Ooh, sweet umami. though. Ooh, mommy. I know. Um, okay, Ooh, I'm like, mommy. I just um, want to say this could have gone real wrong. Oh, I yeah, like I think based on last week, I was I was encouraged that we were in a, a good place because somebody who maybe has picked up a pint or two of ice cream from a gas station in the middle of the night when it comes to novelty ice cream flavors a lot of times mm -hmm. it sounds too good to be true and it usually is right by that i mean like there's some like other like let's mix this with ice cream and call it a thing right and you taste it and you're like oh this tastes like plastic yeah yeah or corn syrup Ooh. this actually tastes like real ice cream and while i would my only complaint is i want more stuff like I want more of the little Debbie stuff okay, in it. So yes. and I can I just say having tried now three flavors. I did the cosmic brownie, which had the sprinkles in it. I did the oatmeal cream pie, which has, you know, like there was something in it, but I don't know what it was. Yeah. This one, the Swiss roll one, my third choice here, actually really has Swiss roll yeah. like cake in it. Mm -hmm. And that to me is the most close to what it's trying to be yeah but they're all good yeah mm -hmm. yeah every single one of them was good and you got these uh, tell people where they can get them because i know a yeah. lot of people have had a hard time finding these uh to grab them and i think it's probably just because everybody's trying to get them so they're exclusive at walmart and like i said there were two other flavors those were completely out at my local walmart those other flavors are what is the strawberry cake Roll the strawberry thing. cake roll. Yeah, it's like a Swiss cake roll, but strawberry. I don't actually like of the little Debbie's offerings. It's my least favorite. I also am surprised that they didn't have, and I'm sorry, you need to finish the, the flavors. The but other flavor that they had, now I'm forgetting it. What was it? It was zebra cakes. Zebra cakes. Thank you. That's that you guys were kind of excited about that one. I just but love that zebra didn't cakes. Come it's like cake with white icing and then a chocolate I just drizzle. Didn't think zebras sounded good in you know, ice cream. It's not actual zebras. What were you going to say, though, Bradley? You were going to say um, something. Of the Little Debbie snacks that I would mix with ice cream, I'm surprised that they did not have Star Crunch because Star Crunch to me is probably one of my favorite all-time Little Debbie snacks. What's a Star Crunch? Star Crunch is like popped uh, or puffed rice with caramel Ooh, and chocolate. Yum. So it's just like, it, it's more, to me, it's like more candy than cookie. But I think that would make a great um, duo with right? ice cream. That might be like a good, if they ever expanded to ice cream bars, I would want that on a stick. Yeah. Ooh, oh, wouldn't absolutely. Wouldn't that be good? Yeah. Or like even like oatmeal cream pie, put some vanilla ice cream in between two of Ooh, those yeah. oatmeal cookies. Right? That would be amazing. I don't know how long, are these like a limited time thing? They must be. I'm assuming just because yeah. all things good must come to an end, but um, I don't know when that would end. So get them while you can. Right. So, yeah. yeah so they are available exclusively at Walmart. And uh, you can, by the way, Walmart does do delivery of food. Yeah. You so got them delivered, right? I did actually have them delivered. And so. Um, and they don't come all melty? No. That's huh? pretty awesome. I mean, you know, it was cold. Don't the order day them in that, July. Yeah. I was going to say the date that they were <laughs> delivered, it was below zero. That so helps. I was like, oh, we've got a natural freezer outside. We're good. Um, yes. But these pints are 250 each oh and God, i think i know it's insane for a pint of ice cream yes yes like do you know i saw ice cream pints for 9.99 at the store the other day Ooh, who's um, spending ten dollars on a pint of ice cream you're doing it wrong okay um and like i said uh i i was kind of giving you guys like the the profiles of each of these i do have descriptions in front of me the oatmeal cream pie though what we were looking at was vanilla cream ice cream with soft oatmeal cookie pieces and a hint of molasses i don't think we got to those oatmeal cookie pieces so i'm gonna eat some more of that in the break let's do it i'll let you know how it goes what did you think oh yeah yeah yeah. i'm, I'm gonna give them like a four all right you guys i'm gonna give the first oatmeal three and then uh swiss roll four holly two four stars two four cars? cobras cobras me. oh yeah we're do cobras Sorry. my god it's like we've yes. never done this before celebrities behaving badly we call them D -bags. After this. oh 